Hello again. Goldsmiths University London, a bastion of identity politics. Their student activists, quick off the mark, criticising others for perceived sexism and racism. But according to a damning report, Insider Outsider, racism and sexism from staff and students directed to ethnic minority students is rampant there. It's obviously the tip of the iceberg. No surprise, really. Abuse, manipulation, class prejudice towards the lower orders, authoritarianism, masquerading as liberation, cult-like politics thrive in these hothouse environments. It's just more galling when you're denounced and trolled by these types who wallow in self-righteousness, yet are unable to see what's going down in their own manner. For their own mental well-being, I suggest these blinkered activists just take a walk down to Deptford High Street, mixed with a genuine, ethnically diverse working class community. But really, why should they? The university bubble is far more comfortable for these middle class posers. Not that the working class locals would appreciate interest from most of these worthies, in particular since the area is under threat from redevelopment and gentrification. This includes more expensive student accommodation. We working class anarcho malcontents don't require lectures and hectoring from these politically correct types. We shall develop our politics on the streets and through our affinity groups, as we always have. Don't require and want any wacko West Coast formulations to make our revolution. Thank you very much. Bye.